morning, afternoon, evening. It is Alexis Arcade, and today is a beautiful day to not be outside, but instead to be back here in the Arc Dev Kit to take a look at a new creature that is set to drop in patch 257, supposedly scheduled for release on April 30th. Now we have a giant buzzing creature, and if you didn't already figure it out from the title, it is the Giant Bee. And it is definitely a big creature. I was not expecting them to be this giant. Like, I thought giant, and I was like, maybe the size of a small dog. But nope, just the size of a human. You know, no big deal. Um, the animations that I have here for the giant bee. This is the eating animation. This is the attack sting animation. Right here, we have the takeoff animation. So, like, when it's walking around on the ground and it just wants to fly away, that is what it is. And then these two are supposedly the queen bee, but I've looked and I don't see any difference in these two physically compared to just your drone bee. So I'm not sure if they're going to be different color or like what's going to go on with it, but yeah, these are the queen bees. So this is just the idle flying animation and then this is just the standard idle animation, which I would presume are the same for those over there. So we'll get, yeah, like I said, we'll have to wait and see for the uh, game to actually, for them to actually come out in the game before we can tell what the difference between the queen and the drones are. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the dossier for the giant bee. Wild. In the wild, a piece Lithormia drones never stray far from their nests, which they build high in the island's redwood trees or on rocky cliff sides. Apis drones can be seen swarming around the nest in groups, but to get a look at the queen apis, one, one would need to crack open the nest itself. Speaking from experience, this is not a pleasant task, as the untamable apis drones are quite territorial. I should have seen that one coming in hindsight. Take caution. Apis stings will significantly weaken any creature which suffers them, and, and because its stinger is not barbed, apis can sting multiple times without its stinger being ripped away. Domesticated. A tamed apis queen will lay new drone eggs in constructed nests that survivors can farm for honey, so long as they remember to wear specialized beekeeping gear. Said honey is not only sweet and delicious, but laced with scents that land mammals find irresistible. Many hunters use it to bait their traps. Apis drones will also follow their queen into battle so they can be used for self-defense in a pinch. So the first thing I take away from that is using these in self-defense. So what, do you just like carry A, the nest, or B, the queen with you, then like throw it out like a seagull or a dimorphodon and hope it attacks? Like that's a pretty funny image in my head. So that's something that I'm looking forward to seeing. And also the, what stands out to me is making sure that they have specialized beekeeping gear. So that means I presume we're going to be having a new set of armor come out so you can properly handle these bees. And along with the bees and the honey, we'll have the new item, the honey. So I wonder how many things we'll be able to make with the honey if it's just gonna be like straight-up honey It'd be cool if they made tea I bet you could probably make tea in primitive plus because well they already have bees in primitive plus so I don't know but yeah, I don't, I'm not sure these guys are going to be of a whole lot of use. They're definitely going to be annoying when you're in the redwoods and in the mountainside. Uh, because you're going to probably get stung by a giant bee. And that's not any fun. I wonder how many actually like herd together. Because I don't want to see about 20 of these running my way. Because I will book it out of there definitely just run and never look back so that is our first look here for the giant bees you guys let me know what you think of them are you gonna go out and tame them i probably will for my channel but other than that i don't i don't think it'll be utilized very much so if you guys like the video please leave a comment or a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe that way you know when i put out a new video and i will talk to you later bye <laughs>